Hey guys, welcome back to another Reef Stash video. This week, we're increasing the flow in the Cade Reef Tank. We're gonna add a Panta Ray. Yep, Panta Ray. Have you heard of that brand before? Right here. These pumps are crazy strong. So I wanted something different for the tank. I already have an MP40. It's not really doing everything I want it to do. I was kind of annoyed that the extension cable didn't reach all the way to this side of the tank that the controller's hooked up to. So I reached out to Unique Corals. They sell Panta Rays. These pumps are killer. We're increasing the flow in this system. We have lots of detritus build up on this end of the tank. All the flow is coming over from this end where the overflow is at. And we just need to get some more flow going on over here. So we're gonna add a pump on this end, which will, all the flow will meet in the middle and just create a complete random flow. Really unique design and style. Super long cable to the controller. Power. Check this controller out. This is really unique. I've never seen anything like this. It's, it has like these little magnets and I don't know all the controls on them, but they do different things. Looks like you slide it to on to turn it on, slide it to off, and it has some different combinations that does the different settings uh, for the pump. First, we're gonna check and see how far this will reach. Dude, this cable is long. I have plenty of room to even cable manage this thing all the way through my under the tank. I have little clips so that when you look in the sump, you don't see a bunch of cables everywhere. All right, we're gonna mount this on this end right here. I think we may change this. We'll just play around with it until we figure out what works best. This is three quarter inch thick glass. Those magnets holding strong. And we're gonna cable manage this around through the back of the tank. are hooked up you can see the pump right here we're gonna kick it on and we'll see what kind of flow we're getting oh that's pretty First up, we're going to set the mode. There's three modes. There's flow mode, wave mode, and profile mode. To set the modes, we're going to turn it until there's one red and two green lights. And all I'm doing is turning the off switch to the right. All right, so now we're in mode setting and we wanna do wave mode. So now we're gonna turn it to two greens. And I'm using the on button to turn it, to set the, the mode. All right, so that is wave mode. Get to wave height. 
we're going to use the off button to go to one green light. Okay, so that's one green light. And then we use the on button to adjust the wave. And the further you go, the higher the percentage, you go to the left, lower the percentage. So that's on the on button to adjust. Then we have wave intensity, which is two green lights. That's a wave intensity. And then we use the on button to adjust it up or down. Okay. And then we have wave duration, which is three green lights. And again, we use the on button to adjust it up and down. Okay. Now to set the settings, all we do is remove the off button and now the settings have set. And if I want to turn the pump on or off, all I need to do is switch to the off to turn it back on. All we do is switch it back to the on. It's that simple. Yeah.